Before you watch this video, please make sure you subscribe, like the video, and press the notification button so that you do not miss another video from this channel. Hi everyone, my name is Noctula Mselegu and you are tuned in to Tenjiwe TV. And today, I am about to present to you seven superstitions the Zulu nations have. Some of them are crazy, but stay tuned in so you don't miss out. And remember guys, if this is your first time tuning in, press the subscribe button, click the notification bell so you can get notified whenever a new video is uploaded. So, let's go. Here we are guys, and let me present to you seven superstitions the Zulu people have. Superstition number one, the Zulu people do not sweep at night. This is because it is believed that if you sweep at night, people who practice witchcraft will come and pick up that dirt that you swept from the house at night and they will use that dirt to perform black magic or witchcraft against the family. Superstition number two, during the thunderstorm. The Zulu people believe that if it's raining with a heavy thunderstorm, they should keep the doors open to make sure that if the lightning comes in, it will leave the house and be not trapped inside the house. They also believe that during a thunderstorm, women should cover their heads with respect to the thunderstorm. And they also believe that they should cover up everything that is shiny, windows, uh, mirrors, needles because such things attract the lightning they also believe that a person should not walk outside especially close to the trees because the trees attract lightning superstition number three ancestral animals the zulu people believe that there are certain animals that if they are seen at home they represent the ancestors for example the green mamba a green mamba has to be a mamba that does not have any spots on his body and if this mamba is spotted in a rendezvous where they burn incense it is believed that this animal represents that the ancestors are present another animal the zulu people believe represents the ancestors is a cricket it's a small tiny insect and they believe that if this insect is spotted around the household the ancestors are present other families differ with their beliefs other families also believe that a chameleon is also a symbol of ancestors and so many more other animals as they differ across different zulu families superstition number four witchcraft animals zulu people also believe that there are certain animals that represent witchcraft for example if that animal is seen at home it is a symbol of black omen for example a black cat whenever a black cat is spotted in a zulu household the zulu people believe that this animal is a black omen a baboon a baboon is said to be used by witchcraft to travel from another place to another place and there is also an owl we know that an owl is a bird that travels at night so zulu people believe that an owl is used by people to practice witchcraft as it is an animal that travels when everyone is asleep it is also believed that there are certain beings that are called dogoloshe or imkovu even though there is no proof to their existence but it is said that these animals reside in the forest and they can be there and play with kids but no one has ever had any proof of their existence superstition number five in a zulu household it is believed that if a crab is spotted in a rendezvous house where incense is burnt it symbolizes that someone within the household is pregnant also it is believed that if a small child is seen playing with ash it is believed that it also symbolizes that someone is pregnant in the household and it is also believed that if you dream eating fruits it is believed that someone in the household is definitely pregnant superstition number six 
the Hadidas, Amankankane in Isizulu. The Hadidas is known for its wandering around the neighborhood and making noise. But the Zulu family believes that if the Hadidas is seen wandering around the same neighborhood several times making noise, it believes that this bed symbolizes death. And surely if this bed has been seen wandering around the neighborhood, death will strike the neighborhood. Last but not least, superstition number seven, an itch on a hand or a feet. Zulu people believe that if you get an itch on your right hand, it means that you are going to get money or you are going to find money while walking around the streets. And they also believe that if it itches on your left hand side, you are going to lose money. They also believe that if you get an itch on your feet, it symbolizes that you will have to go somewhere. Thank, Thank you for tuning in and that will be the end for today. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, share the video and comment on what you think about these Zulu people's superstitions. And again guys, do not forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever a new video is uploaded. Thank you for tuning in to Tendua TV.